What's up, everybody? Crypto Muscle coming back to you with another YouTube video. And in this video, I wanted to give you guys the latest on Ah ETH Plus, Nexums, Probit Exchange. I'm gonna take a look at Bitcoin Vault too. Why? You know, I was gonna look at it, but I'm gonna look at it right now. See where it's at. Let's see if. Oh, look at that. It's continuing to drop. So Bitcoin Vault. I was looking at it yesterday. It was around 125. Uh, I don't even know what it was on my last video. I think it was like 126, 127, 128, somewhere around there. Uh, let's see here. We can take a look at the past day. Uh, I couldn't believe it was as low as $99. The other day, I was like, wow. That's what it said there. Yeah, it's been kind of going sideways the last few hours. Uh, let's see here. Yeah. So in the past day, it dropped from where I saw it. I was like 128, whatever. And... It's been dropping, going sideways around 117. Yeah, 117 mark. So, interesting. Look at that. Continuing to drop, drop, drop. So, that's why I say it's, I think the, I've been saying it over and over. The, the run is over. Hey, look at that. $99. The lowest it's, uh, it hit this past week okay so the past 24 hours 114 dollars is where it hit but it's been going a little bit sideways now at 117 all right so jumping back over to eth plus this thing has dropped more as well because when i did my last video it was around the six dollar almost seven dollar mark and it's kind of gone down even more to the four dollar around this mark here it's been hovering around between four dollars and fifteen cents and four twenty. This is on the BTC, by the way. Because I was looking at this, is it's cheaper, slightly, versus here. It's been hovering around more closer to four dollars and thirty cents uh, on the ETH to ETH plus pairing, and a little bit cheaper as this is, you know, look at that four eighteen. So for BTC, so. I figured uh, my plan still is to, I did open up a second account now, and the thing about just throwing it into this plan right here, just to spur the binary going, and um, see that's my second account, and this is my first account here, got the thousand dollar plan, and this is what's been averaging uh, these last four days I started earning, as you can see here, between 12 and 11, there, that's just based off of um, what I got going on over here, I got nothing on the right, that's what I said, I just want to kind of maximize my earnings, and I figured I'd wait on the purchasing of it, that's why I didn't buy in at the video, you know, during my last video, because... I didn't know if that was going to be bottom. I'm waiting to, for it to hit bottom because I figured there's going to be a point where it's going to eventually go back up. And I thought at that point it was kind of the bottom. But man, when I came back in later on today, the bottom might be here now, looks like. So I figured I'm looking at for ETH Plus. I got, I went into the $1,000 uh, Nexums. And then I also bought a hunter here at the $25 price. So I'm try so I was trying to figure out how much I put in Nexums with a thousand dollars. I only got forty when you think about it, right? Because around the $25 mark and thousand dollar Nexums plan, you figured uh it's around forty. That's what I calculated. And I put a hunter here or I purchased a hunter here, so I have a hundred and forty. So I figured at this price, I could get another 150 more, and 
it'll only cost me like around 600 some dollars. And then I could throw part of it into that $500 plan. And then uh, I could do other things with the remaining ETH Plus that I got here. So um, that's just a thought. But one thing I wanted to share, or it's a couple things I actually wanted to share. So here's the staking event with ETH Plus that they're doing here on ProBit. They're doing 20,000 ETH or Ethereum Plus in rewards. This was just started yesterday. And they're allocating this till this, this runs out. So you got two ways of staking it. 30 days to or 90 days. And maximum per account is 222,000 ETH Plus. And uh, per time. No limit over the course of the event. And all you gotta do is hit join, and all you need a minimum is half an ETH plus. And then you put it in, these are the rewards that you get, 2% on the 30 days. And if you do the 90 days, that's 3 months, you get 9% staking. And so, you cannot with trade or withdraw during the staking time, so if there's a price spike and you're in this thing locked, especially in the 90 days, you're stuck in there can't get it out um, this campaign will be available till further notice and uh, yeah if I guess if issues with Nexums gets itself worked out um, then it'll be all good right and I guess the, more, the issues is more or less um, people just trying to be the people behind Nexums you know I guess, you know, we're supporting all that. And so that's what's happening with this one. So with Nexums, you know, my, my th thought is to do this to get the right leg going on well, my second plan here. That way I could get this thing going. And then I got both of them going on and producing ETH plus. And if there's some price action, then I think based on my overall second purchase on the exchange, will help mitigate the original over time, but we'll see. Uh, that's just a thought right now. And uh, I wanted to share with you guys uh, the whole, I guess, thing with the webinar and and the thoughts that are out there. So this is courtesy of Crypto Don, so I can't take the credit. This is all Crypto Don and... Um, about what went on with the webinar and all that and I wanted to share that with you guys and what's coming with uh, Ethereum plus Nexums you know the because you know they go hand in hand together so they work as a team together so uh, this is what was said for anyone who did not make the live uh, the webinar and are wondering why the fall in Ethereum plus price uh, it was pretty much panic so when the markets were adjusting people had a panic and sold 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 at lower and lower prices and then when you see it people started reacting and uh, people started dumping you know people started <laughs> to go with it because everybody thought oh shit the bottom's falling out I got to get out you know and so that's what happened there and they looked at it as the original people that bought this, like at the 10 cents, 20 cents and all that, thought, you know what? I made some money on this thing at, you know, at $25. It's, it's looking pretty good right now. I want to take some profits. And that's what a lot of people started doing was taking profits at the $25, $26 mark. And that's what happened. It kind of triggered a panic sell when people started seeing that people started taking profit. So that's what happened here. And that is why it's encouraged for everyone who has Ethereum Plus to hold and buy more as we can raise the price back up. So this is what's coming with uh, Ethereum Plus. You got uh, they're gonna make strategic. They are yeah they're gonna make strategic alliances to enter the second stage of the project. For usability, transactionality, security, you can use ETH Plus to buy goods and services around the world as you can monetize 
Uh, Ethereum Plus through the ATMs around the world. Uh, an imminent takeoff's coming. My recommendation is for investors to buy. For those who have already have coins, put up with them for the next 90 days. And that's from Fernando. So, that's the whole thing with um, staking it. He's talking about for the next 90 days. And CryptoDon said that uh, support should be online now. So if you have any issues, you put in your support tickets. And uh, to let him know if they're responsive. So he doesn't have any info on what the future may bring. But he hopes that the way things are going, it's going to spur to go in the right direction. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, uh, here's a mention here of the, what's his name, Sean Logan. Let's see, fit, said that he failed to show security features of the ETH+. Plus. I think that played a part as well. Um, and that was something that, I don't know, wasn't mentioned. And so, from Fernando here, uh, let's see, look, this business is not about security features. My advisors tell me about double-edged sort of talk of the security assets because a scammer can do more early things and that would be later. I cannot show to the public this security assets for anyone and the situation here. I mean, dump of the coin show the security settings would be, uh, whatever he says here, nephatic to the project. So tell Sean Logan, sorry to not show, that's not the situation of the dump. Um, that's what he was trying to say. Uh, it was yet, but it was said that it was based on how it pumped so hard, I guess, that the old sellers that bought tokens at 11 to 20 cents wanted to take profit. So he was trying to say, stop footing, stop, you know, trying to cause all this stuff. And Crypto Don just kind of reiterated, you, you know, do you guys understand what's happening now, you know? Uh, so that's what he was saying there. And here, funny thing is, Sean has made a huge team of Mining City, but doesn't talk much about the security features, and it's been out for months. So, you know, which is true, right? Because, you know, you're pumping one platform, and that's what... I mean, Sean Logan's about, right? He's all about referral, whoring, and shilling, and all that. And it reminds me of Miss Crypto Flower. I miss Crypto Flower. What happened to Crypto Flower? So, I guess here's a translation of... <laughs> a straight translation here. So, the dump is normal because we raised fast price, not by manipulating new users and, new, and, new, and low circulations of supply is pumped high so this would happen uh, people just want to take profit so he's just saying just kind of hang on and uh you know we'll see what happens here nexums is a partnership uh to give the supply of tokens to the community by earning uh by token trade on our various exchanges so this is what he's talking about but if you uh you know you have two options you can still put it on Nexum, that's what he's trying to tell you, because that's part of the partnership, and you can also stake it on ProBit, which I just talked about, so, I said some of the things that was talked about here in this whole uh, webinar thing, is that it was mainly uh, people taking profit from the early, early people that got into this thing, and, uh, yeah, a little bit of security features, um, could play it a part but you know when you have someone big like uh, Sean Logan that can say something and put it out there it can also you know affect the project as well so like I said my plan is to purchase some more of this stuff hopefully this is around the bottom and uh, get the same amount that I got combined 140 plus maybe 150 I'll get and then put it back in my second account and go from there. And hopefully this thing will blow up. So that's the plan. 
So comment down below, let me know what you think. Links down below, and uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next one.